Hey, it's Dino, did you spin crypto? I got this box in the mail today. Rather undescriptive box. But you're gonna wanna see what's in this box. I'm gonna show it to you. So get ready for, get ready for, get ready for a digit spin crypto. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Sit back and enjoy the show. Just let me know which way you go. Get ready for, get ready for, get ready for. Digit spin crypto. <laughs> so, out of the clear blue sky, I get this box. I have no idea. I didn't order anything. But you want to know what's in it. Well, I popped this baby open, and I was quite surprised. I was quite happy. It's pretty clever. And I'm going to show you what it is. Because you may want one of these yourself. Or even a better one. They have all different types. But this is the coolest thing ever. Let's pop this thing right open. Came packaged in the small box and it's all wrapped up in bubble wrap. It has uh, no instructions. There was no letter. No nothing. It was just sent to me. Ah, I took a look at the paper and I thought maybe there would be a letter to me or something. Nothing just shipped and I read it and I said oh that, that looks pretty good that looks pretty cool so I'll open the packaging and inside was this little box now being that I'm a 3d printing expert I've been doing it for about 10 years most people just learning about it, but I've been doing 3D printing for 10 years. I immediately recognized that it was a 3D printed box. I saw on the back, you can see it's 3D printed. It's got the, the rasterization on the sides. But whoever printed it did it in, uh, in a tight formation, point, probably a, a 0.1. So it's, it's really tight, it's really clean. Whatever printer they used was uh, was a pretty good printer has a nice face plate and it has this uh, USB connection in the back it's your standard USB and what looks like a, uh, a screen so you know the electronic you know I, I got 30 years of digital electronics and computer software engineering behind me so I'm like all right somebody made something pretty cool I just hope it doesn't do something weird <laughs> <laughs> so first thing i want to do is pop it open i saw the back and it popped open nice little plate very well uh, very nicely 3d printed and uh, inside i can see uh what looks like a uh, an arduino mini not a mi not a micro but an arduino mini mini so that means this thing could be doing all sorts of stuff. So of course I had to go to the directions. Take a look at it. And the uh, directions are saying, Crypto Coin Display. User manual. All right, tells me to plug it into any power source. Now, I, I didn't want to plug this into my computer. I don't, you know, what's it gonna do? Download all sorts of stuff into my PC. <laughs> so I. I wasn't sure, you know, I don't know, something shows up in the mail, you just don't plug it in. So I plug it into a power source, so I, I, I took the uh, device and I uh, put it back together, snapped together nice and clean, and I hooked it up to a, a, uh, a battery pack. This battery pack, uh, it's got 100% on it there, it's a 20,000 amp, uh, 20,000 milliamp uh, thing, and then it came up nice the screen very easy to read very clean and uh, basically it, it uh, when I first loaded it uh, it, it doesn't come up it, uh, it it connects up to stuff this one I've configured and and did everything too 
and I put my favorite coins in there. I got uh, Bitcoin, Ethereum. I got uh, Ripple. I got uh, Ethereum Classic. And I've got the Electronium. And this gives me the real time price. And it's, uh, I have it running off of a battery pack. And I'm gonna tell you, I've been running it for about two hours. And the damn battery still says 100%. So this thing would probably run for a week <laughs> on this particular battery pack. And I could take this thing and just put it anywhere. I could put it on my desk next to my computer. Uh, you know, what's the price? So I could take a quick look. Frick, Bitcoin just hit 10,000. It's in space. It was 9,700 about an hour ago. It's 10.3, whatever. Ripples up to 21 cents. Ethereum Classic hitting seven dollars ten cents, and Electronium eighty six point eighty point eighty six of a penny. So it's uh, it's all good stuff. Amazing to see and uh, to watch this all in real time. Now looking at the directions, uh, this connects up to Coin Gecko uh, through my network through my Wi-Fi. So basically. Uh, you, um, uh, when you first start it up, it starts up its own network, and uh, you have a blank screen. And what ends up happening is, is that uh, uh, you take your mobile phone and you connect to the to the network that this is transmitting, and uh, you connect to it, and it's got a web page. And on that web page, uh, you set up uh, the name of your, you know, you click the the network and uh, put in your password and then uh, you go down a little bit further and there are uh, text fields to put your favorite coins in and there's a whole lot of stuff and if you go to the, the uh, cryptocoindisplay.com uh, there's a uh, coin list and it gives you the verbiage that you have to type in for particular coins you know electronium is electronium but uh, there's a whole bunch of data that can be collected and have this displayed on there and you definitely want to check it out now if I go to uh, let's let's bring up their website now I'm, I'm basically I'm just gonna do a review on this thing since they sent it to me uh, and I would assume that's what they wanted uh, um, I wasn't paid uh, for this uh, in any way but uh, I did receive the device in the mail for the review um, there was no letter in it or anything, so uh, they they didn't uh, have a request to send it back. So I'm assuming uh, they wanted me to keep it. So I'm going to keep it. So that's in all transparency, so this way you know. But uh, it was not paid in any way uh, for this. I thought it was a cool product. And if it's a cool product, somebody sends me something and it's cool and it's useful for everybody, I'm going to show it to you so you get the chance to take a look at this darn thing, uh, which is basically just the cube itself uh, hooked up to whatever uh, USB power source. All right, so let's go to this uh, uh, crypto, crypto coin display.com. Now, it looks like it's a, I don't know if it's an Etsy page or what have you. If you go to the, if you go to the shop section, Let's, let's move this over here a little bit so you guys can see it. Go to the shop section. They have different types. They have this one with this Bitcoin one. This is pretty cool, and it's got a... Um, let's, uh, let's open this up here. This one's pretty cool. It's got a, a, a light tower, a Bitcoin crypto light tower, which is neat. And, uh, and it has the price ticker down below. And again, you can still put up to 10 different cryptos. Uh, in inside log it in and it'll display the crypto name and price uh, for each one through this uh, scrolling display banner which is kind of cool I don't know how big the darn thing is uh, I don't know if there's any uh, any dimensions here we go dimensions eight inch by five inch so uh, you know it's a it's a reasonable size about eight inches about like yay big um, so that's that's pretty clever pretty neat and uh, it's 99 bucks the one that they uh, uh, they say they accepted uh, crypto, but if I go to more payment options, I didn't see that as an option here. So I'm not sure how they're handling uh, paying for it with crypto. I don't know if you have to contact them or 
what have you. I see PayPal, GPAL, ShopPay. Um, let's see, ShopPay. Let's take a look at that. ShopPay. Uh, total 99 USD. So, um, it, this looks like it's done all in Shopify, which is pretty cool. So I'm not sure if they're if they're you know you contact them and you send them the crypto and then they'll send you a discount or a gift card number to put in. I'm not sure, but uh, you you know you guys may tinker around with it. What they sent me was this uh, mini, which is pretty neat. Uh, the ticker display. I thought that was uh, pretty sexy. They also had this uh, this version here, which is a color display. Which is a similar device, uh, more of a more of a pyramid style, but it's in color, which is neat. Real clever. I, I, congratulations to you, uh, Crypto Coin Display. I, I, this is really cool. It's really cool. I don't have to, you know, keep all these windows open. I could just keep this thing next to my desktop, and uh, and, and you know, and just kind of poke and take a look, see what it says every few minutes. <laughs> CMC, what's the price? <laughs> and uh, and go from there. Now, what I was going to tell you is about they have this crypto ID list. So you come here and you can go down and you have, geez, all sorts of uh, of coin, different types of Bitcoin, Bitcoin Gold, Bitcoin Max, Monster, anything that's on Coin Gecko uh, looks like it would be available. And the list just goes on and on. Bunny coin, bite them, uh, car block. I mean, there's just stuff on here. Castle. <laughs> there's coins I've never heard of. Uh, syndicator, cloud mining. What's this here? Cloud, cloud mining. I, I I don't know if they have things like, uh, you know, um, uh, Bitcoin dominance or anything. Uh, let's take a look at Bitcoin. Bitcoin, Bitnode, Bitcoin, BitPay, uh, Bitcoin Diamond. So no, there's no Bitcoin dominance, but there's uh, a lot of really neat stuff in here. Anyway, there's Electronium down to all sorts of stuff. I mean, just about every every coin. I think they put all all three, four, five thousand coins in here, and uh, Ether, Ether Token, Ether Ethereum Classic. E gold, dogs, digit, digital. It looks like a dent is in here, but um, a lot of really neat stuff. Anyway, um, you look for the coin that you're looking for, and next to it there'll be some verbiage um, in parentheses, and that is the text that you will enter in uh, to the website uh, that you connect to. So when a thing comes up, it creates its own website. And you connect to it. You give it the network uh, configuration. Let's put the. You give it the network configuration and uh, the password to your network, and then um, so it can log on. Then it has communications. The Coin Gecko's API uh, pulls down the information that uh, you asked for in the from the coin list uh, that's behind me and uh voila and it's off to the races and you can like i said you can run it off of a battery uh you can run it off of uh your local device or any usb power source uh which is pretty cool so um overall you know i'm gonna be honest with you for 59 bucks or was it 50 bucks i think the the puppy sells for a 49.99 uh, that's a i know what the parts cost to do this I don't know if this is made in China and they're distributed here. I wouldn't be surprised, but um, please excuse me <laughs> if I got it wrong there. Uh, crypto coin display and they're all made in the United States. I didn't see anything that says made in the USA. So, and I didn't see anything that says made in China. So I don't know where uh, this is produced or manufactured. Uh, well, maybe, it just may be made here in the States. Now, if it, if it was made in China, I guarantee you they would say it on it. But since it doesn't, I'm gonna go on the. Uh, I'm gonna stick my my neck out and I'm gonna say it's made in the states here. So um, I'm hoping so because this would be a really cool item. And at uh, 49.99, I'm not exactly sure how they put this together because uh, you know I know the the prices of some of the parts 
um, and the time that takes to uh, pr to print this, they uh, did a solid fill on it, so the thing is is not going anywhere. It's 3D printed, but I mean it's it's a good solid fill uh, on the print. Uh, the machines that they're using to print it are obviously uh, pretty sharp, pretty clean. Uh, they, they're doing a great job. He's using probably a small nozzle to be able to get this text <clears throat> that's uh, shown on the back for the reset button. So if you make a mistake or it doesn't come up correctly, on the bottom there's a reset hole and there's a button in there. And you take a paper clip and you hold it in uh, and then let go and then you hold it in again and then let it go and it'll reset it back to nothing where it'll be a blank screen. Uh, and you go to your phone and you'll see the uh, crypto coin display network you connect to it um, and then again uh, use your web browser uh, to, con to reconfigure it again so you can reset it at any point and put in the, the coins that you love and cherish so um, overall I'm gonna give this thing a, a, you know it's clean that the case um, uh, isn't bad obviously like I said it's 3d printed so it's not a premium you know a premium device or a premium case but uh, at the price point that they're selling it for it's uh, well worth it it's it's pretty clean they might be able to do something where they can uh, have a, a premium option if they these are big sellers and they can make a premium option but uh, I, I don't know what the quantity is that he's uh, selling he, he or she is selling these uh, uh, at um, but at $49, you're getting your money's worth. Because even if you went to build this, the research and development time to write all the code, connect to the API, uh, getting the uh, the mini Arduino board, the display uh, for it, uh, you, you're going to be spending, uh, I forget, 13 20 yeah, you know, there, this guy is spending $25 to build this thing. Um, never mind his labor, you know, his labor and what have you. Luckily, a lot of it is, uh, you know, comp uh, robot print, robot made. But uh, uh, you couldn't replicate this uh, uh, without making, uh, uh, buying them in quantity, uh, all the parts in quantity and everything. And then all of your time and effort to write the code uh, to make it happen. Though... Um, it's probably not that sophisticated. Um, it is extremely clever. Uh, so at forty nine ninety five, I'm not sure I would be able to sell this at forty nine ninety five manufacturing something like this. So I, I personally think it's a, a a very fair price point for the device. And uh, and the Bitcoin one at uh, at a hundred dollars, I might even get one of those. It's a little bit bigger. It's got lights in it that change color, the LED uh, um, uh, capabilities in it, and um, I'm very pleased with it. I, I would uh, spend forty nine ninety five for this, and uh, I think it's it's quite clever. For an additional thirty bucks, you can get the color screen version. And then the Bitcoin uh, version, which is pretty cool. Um, I think that's pretty exciting uh, to see. So um, I don't know. I may I may uh, spring for the hundred bucks and get myself the Bitcoin vo uh, version. The ticker. I, I like the screen better than the ticker display. Uh, the ticker scroll. Um, but to go into a bigger screen, that would fill that, that it would cost uh, significantly more. So the ticker allows them to keep it at that $100 price. I think all these prices are, are, are more than fair. More than fair. Um, you know, the, the guy's entitled to, to earn a few dollars on each one. And, um, and, and obviously he's doing that for his efforts uh, that he's put into this uh, neat little gadget. And uh, if you're looking to support uh, somebody that's making a cool crypto gadget, I uh, give this a digit spin approved product. And I think this is pretty spectacular. Really excited about it. I'm going to be uh, prominently keeping it on my desk. I don't know, I might even put it in the show <laughs> each day and keep it, keep it off to the side. You know, I'm going to put it on a little, <laughs> a little display here so we can see it. Uh, uh, I'm gonna come up with some ideas, but I think I might keep it on the show so that uh, we can see the the pricing in real time during the shows <laughs> instead of 
instead of digitally putting it on the screen. I just think this thing is so clever. Uh, I think I'll put it on a little tripod or something, and I'll keep it, you know, up like right here or something like that. <laughs> Don't be surprised if that happens. Uh, Ethereum, two hundred and fifty dollars. Holy smokes, everything's going crazy. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I have a feeling that we're starting our uh, our Bitcoin bull run. Even Ripple at twenty one. Let's see here, ten thousand two hundred. One hundred eleven dollars. So we're starting it. Uh, I can't wait to see it. Uh, say uh, fourteen thousand <laughs> for Bitcoin on here uh, pretty soon. So do yourself a favor. Go out and get yourself one of these things. It's well worth the time and effort. Instructions are easy. It's uh, front and back. It literally took me uh, two minutes. Two minutes to set the thing up. And. Uh, um, I want to thank uh, Crypto Coin Display for sending this in for me to review and uh, to take a look at it. Um, definitely something you want to get a hold of. Definitely something you want to put on your desk or have available for yourself. Congratulations to you guys. Crypto Coin Display did a great job. I appreciate you sending this in to, to be reviewed. It's fantastic and I'm really happy about it. Alright you guys, I'll talk to you later. See you next time.